goes the whistle. There goes the whistle. That is the final whistle. Chelsea nil. Chelsea nil. Manchester City 2. The champions get off to a winning start. Erling Haaland 18 minutes in and Kovacic 84 minutes in has sealed the deal. And it's a bad start for Chelsea. It is a bad, bad start for Chelsea. Uh, this season is pretty much business as usual for Manchester City. Man of the match. I don't know. I'm definitely going to go with Doku. I think the highest player uh, rated. The highest rated player in this match is Doku. Doku has been causing a lot of issues. So if Doku is your man of the match, let me know in the comment section. Go ahead and smash that like if you think Doku is your man of the match. But look, I think Chelsea will be in a, in a very difficult position this season. They still have 44 players, outstanding players, and they need to shrink the squad. They need to shrink the squad. And up front, we've seen what they're lacking today, Chelsea. They don't have a pure number nine striker. Jackson is not the answer. We've seen it last season. We've seen it the season before. If you're going to stick with them, you will be ending up finishing eight or seven. I'm telling you, that's what's going to happen. They need to go ahead and sign Osman if they want to be serious this season. That's as simple as that. I think that's the only weakness for Chelsea. And the other question for Chelsea is the manager. I don't know him. I mean, he, he came from Leicester, but I, I really don't know him how good he is. But it doesn't look like he's a convincing manager. He was just looking like clueless out there today. So, yeah, there's a lot of things to worry about for Chelsea uh, this season. As for Manchester City, like I said, business as usual. Haaland getting on the score sheet. Kovacic uh, sealing the deal uh, to score the second goal. But Doku had a great game. Kevin De Bruyne didn't even get into the second gear. Did not even get into the second gear. And it was comfortable. It was really comfortable for Manchester City. The moment they scored the first goal, they were just cruising in this game, bro. They were cruising in this game. And who's going to stop Manchester City? Who's going to stop Manchester City? They're still the favorites in my eyes for this season to win the Premier League. But yeah, upcoming games for Manchester City will be against Ipswich Town uh, at home. That's going to be on Saturday. And for Chelsea, they will be playing against... Um, Next, they will be playing against uh, Wolves away from home. So that's going to be difficult as well. That will be a difficult game for, for them as well. So we'll see. But yeah, guys, Abdi, Alpha, all of you guys, uh, Julie, thank you all for joining us. Before you leave, like I said, make sure you smash that like on the stream, subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. And uh, within, a, within, a, within a couple of hours, we're going to be live for a Real Madrid match for Kelly and Bobby. So make sure if you want to see that, make sure you tune in for that. But yeah, guys, that is it. Thank you all for watching. Let me know in the comment sections what you think about Chelsea. How far Chelsea uh, can compete or what position are they going to finish in the Premier League? Let me know. Can they finish in the top four? What is going to happen? Can they win a cup, the Carabao Cup, the FA Cup, or the, uh, um, what is it called? The Conference League. Are they going to do that? You guys let me know in the comment sections. And are you confident about the manager as well? You let me know in the comment sections. But that is it, people. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace.